Hello, YouTube. Chrome Freak here. We're here with Dave. Hi there, Dave. Howdy, howdy. Ian. Hey, everybody. We got Les back there with a customer. And um, Dave here looking at a couple of Uzis. Got a couple of civilian versions of the Uzi right here. Collapsible stock. We're going to do a basic field strip of them. We just wanted to throw up a quick video. Dave wanted to show these Uzis. Um, love Uzis. Always have. They're just great guns. All right, this one's going out. Yep. Bye. Later. That Southern one's on, Yankee, that one's on fire, KW folks. Gunworks. This was my first gun when I turned 18. No kidding. Absolutely. That so is as awesome. You can see, it's been in my possession 20 plus years. That's a great story. That's your first gun. First gun. That is sweet. Paid a lot less than what it cost. <laughs> yeah, you think? All right, if we're going to just do a basic field strip today. Obviously, make sure the gun is unloaded. Um, yeah, we'll have to leave the stock fully extended. Take the Uzi apart. Right up here, there's a button you're going to pull back on. Pull your cover off. Expose your internals. Sweet. Pull back on your bolt. Pull it out. Separate the spring, the bolt. Oh, the simplicity, baby. The barrel. There she goes. That's basic field stripping. If you want to take the trigger group apart, you push this pin right here in the back. Fingers in there. Push it through. I got baby. Let's go. Get it. If I can. Come on, girl. It's a little tight. Out. It'll get it, man. It's it. always because the camera's on. When the camera's exactly. on, that's just what happens. On, everything goes he could close his eyes and take that apart. Exactly. Well, you get a little problems. You turn the camera on, that's you what happens. But it's real, this. baby. Push it through. There it goes. Oh, a little bit more. Oh, almost there. No use. <laughs> Did you see that face? Don't there break the dang glass. No, I'm not to break the That's the other problem we have here. Yeah, exactly. We're working on top of glass yeah. tops here, so. Hold on. We wish I'd have taken your challenge now. <laughs> we were going to actually do a, we're a video. Do a little race here, and uh, <laughs> I'm trying to get this out. There it goes. A little love. Oh. And we got it. See, we're live. It's okay, guys. Sorry about the little camera work. No, no, it's no big deal. We just dropped the trigger group. And we'll get back together quicker. Yeah. Right? <laughs> trigger group. Yeah. All right, line it up. These guns are great, guys. Watch. Watch this. Pin in. You do the bolt. All right, the bolt is real simple. Firing pin. See this little tit here? Right there? Yes. You need to put your firing pin in there, in the hole. Make sure the little flap is done. See how that is? Spring in. She goes together better than she comes apart. It's a camera, I'm telling you. If the camera went on, it would have come right, right before. Almost there. <laughs> oh, I should have taken a challenge earlier. Hey, you would have won some beer. I don't know. It would have been wrong with me. And the barrel. Which I'm going to talk about here in just a second. All right. Function check. Oh. Rip it. There you go. Yeah, I mean, Uzis are great. There's so many guns that copied the Uzi. And one of the things about the Uzi is the barrel. You remove the whole barrel. They did that. That was part of the original design because fully auto, you'll burn a barrel out. And it's just quick, easy, and bam. You're back in the freaking ball game with a brand new barrel. I mean, the full auto is fire from the open bolt? Yep, open bolt design. Closed bolt. Absolutely. They're just great guns, man. These things have been around forever. They're still around, still Mag being used. Mag yep. release. I release down there. Grip safety. Manual yep. safety. Yep. Everything comes off in components, as you've seen, trigger group, every, or the entire trigger group, um, grip and all coming off. I mean, just it's just a simple design. It's I love simple. And... The Israelis got it right with this gun. They really did. This is the, one of the most copied guns out there, I think. I'm going to say it is. They're great guns. And like I said, still being used today. We thought we'd do a video. We wanted to do a quick one. Brandon's not here today. And Dave and I had actually planned on doing, like we said, we were going to kind of race and do both these guns. And um, also try to, you know, show people who don't know anything about the Uzi a couple of little things about them. As we went along. That time it went Yeah, well. it did. It went right up for it, of course. But um, anyway, we, this is going to be a quick video. I'm going to end it as quick as I can here. It's an awesome gun, guys. Uzis are 
If you want to know anything about it, give Dave a call. Give, a, give me a call here at the shop or get, don't get a hold of us on YouTube. Rinkos. If you yeah. see a Norinco, don't buy it. Especially. Exactly. Not that I'm bad mouthing the Norinco, right? <laughs> They make good AK-47s. Yeah. 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 Well, if you're going to get a newsie, you know what you want to get. So. Absolutely. Yeah. Anyway, guys, uh, we're going to end this video. Les back there with a the customer. We'll show the customer's face. But, um, yeah, guys, man, i got a bunch of gunsmith work going on in the back. It's just so busy. I haven't had time to set up a tripod and film what I'm doing. But maybe next Saturday I can do that. Maybe Dave even help me out a little bit. And, um, maybe we'll race next week. Yeah, we'll do the race. Uh, all right. By the way, yes. suppressors. Five months, three weeks. Awesome. My tax stamp. Yeah, so oh, congratulations. That soon enough, folks. There you go. Yeah, we got to get over to the range, Dave, man. We got to do another range video. That's just time, guys. It's time that's very hard for all of us. We're busy. And um, anyway, throw out there what you guys want to see. We got a whole shop full of guns here, as you know. Let us know what you want to see, and we'll see if we can't do it. All right, guys. Say bye, Dave. See ya.